Okay guys, I just want to come on and quickly show you um, my new, well it's not new craft room, it's just redone. I've kind of reshuffled, reorganised, redone, everything. So I'll give you a quick span around and then I'll actually show you what I've done to store some of my stuff. Now, a lot of the stuff that we've got, I've got in here, um, is actually second hand. So these were um, office supply um, chests of drawers, and I think they're actually office drawers, but um, like they've got a really big bottom drawer in them. So, and they're actually holding up this desk across here. So, which the desktop itself is just a desktop from Bunnings. So, on the top of this one over here, I have all my pre cut tags, journal cards, scrapbook paper, tools, printer. This one here has my computer. Um, then I have more tools and stuff in here. This little set of drawers here has cardstock pieces, acetate and tissue paper, journal ledger papers, and then stamps and stuff down the bottom. Now, in my two door pantry, up the top there, all in boxes, there's chipboard, fussy cuts, die cuts, glitter paints, uh, boxes of words, markers, buttons, ring lights and in my pantry just let me kick the garbage bin out of the way okay so all of those little coloured boxes over here they're all individually labelled with um, stickers so I've got Alice, I've got mushrooms, nature, butterflies, space, fashion uh, steampunk, all of that. Uh, these baskets have got trims and bits and pieces in them. These are all got dyes in them and coloured cardboard. They're all colour coded. Uh, in the, I've got some photo paper in this one, uh, an embossing machine, another box of trims, manila folders over this side, and then down here on the bottom. I've got big boxes of stamps, a Sherlock Holmes book, uh, box, and some more of my big tools. So that's in that cupboard. Over here on the cubes, we've got journal pages, steampunk, oriental stamps, um, six by six papers, Alice in Wonderland, mixed box, uh, which has got mixed scraps in it, uh, mixed scrap paper, corrugated paper, washi tape, uh, book page pockets, charms, all my little ink and wax seal thingamabobs. Uh, then we've got Egyptian, uh, mixed ephemera, tea stained paper, another little box of mixed ephemera, card blanks, gypsy, fashion, vintage. Then we've got serviettes, cellophane bags and we've got an elephant bun I've got a washing another washi tape there distress inks an oriental box down the bottom way down there and then I've got ephemera butterfly cards dragons bling Harry Potter and then up the top is more scrapbook paper and then up in this other little cube up the top is just all little um, boxes uh, which are all labelled. I've got whale tails, polymer clay, um, butterflies, flowers, paper clips, um, ephemera. The, in these ones here, uh, like the stamps, tea cards, ephemera, ticket ephemera, flowers, butterflies. Uh, this one's got mini envelopes, number labels, mini playing cards, and that kind of thing. Up here is 
uh, silicon molds, sten plastic stencils, ephemera and wooden mounted stamps. And then I have little jars of paper clips, um, book corners, brads, and then there's some more coloured card stock across the back and there's some pianola rolls. My sewing machine's down the bottom with the sewing machine box. This shelf, we got this for $15 and we just put some little um, support bars underneath the shelves so that it could hold a little bit more weight. Then I've got a box in the corner with just all my wallpaper rolls and bits and pieces in it. And then over here in the wardrobe, okay, so I have sewing patterns, uh, boxes with glue, printer ink, um, there's another box of serviettes, jewellery pieces, corrugated pie, uh, paper, bling, um, little jewellery bits and pieces, ink pads, playing cards, uh, waxed thread, embossing folders, drawing inks, copy paper, my craft towels. And then on the other side, we have, which I haven't labelled yet, because I forgot all about this shelf. Okay, so in there there's um, nail glitter and bling, and then there's beads and more beads, and then there's some um, ledger books, uh, lined paper books, and I think that's just, uh, oh, their spare, their spare um, glue guns up there. And then up the top is just big um, art books, diary, like uh, drawing books and that, that you yeah, like just for paper, all that kind of stuff. On here, I've got all my glues and and things, baby wipes, all my little uh, tool bits and pieces in there. And then there's my overlocker and my typewriter. So, uh, and up here on this one, that's all my wire baskets filled with lace, all different types of lace, trims and things. I have some journals that are partly finished, one that was given to me by a gay piper and there's one in my other room that I got off um, Christy Phillips. And so yeah, just little bits and pieces, that's my big jewellery stand with my steampunk hat on there. But so yeah, so now I'm finished, everything has a place, everything has a label and hopefully everything will stay clean we can only hope all right guys just thought i'd give you a, a quick run through of the new craft room hope you all like it um and anybody that wants to come and play come and play okay catch you later guys bye